She's got quite the social media following after being dubbed the world's hottest scientist. Now she's making headlines because she's been diagnosed with dengue fever. Now she didn't get it here, but there are a few cases of dengue fever being contracted in this country. Rosie Moore is known as the world's hottest scientist. Social media is loaded with images of her in pursuit of science, all while looking incredibly hot. But on a recent research trip to the Amazon rainforest, she contracted a terrifying tropical disease. I don't think people understand, like it's actually like pretty rampant right now. It's dengue fever, and it's spread by a bite from the Asian tiger mosquito, which has invaded the U.S. When did you realize something's not quite right? I don't feel well. My first symptom that was really concerning was everywhere I looked, like to the right or to the left, like it felt like somebody was pulling the eyeballs out of my head. Then came this horrifying rash from head to toe. The rash was insane. I've never had a rash like that either, which was another like very alarming symptom is I just woke up one day and like my palms of my hands and my feet and my full body was just covered in this rash. When Rosie returned to her home in Florida from her Amazon adventure, dengue still wasn't done. My hair started falling out rapidly, like I was actually balding. The city of Paris is getting ready to host the Olympics next month and there are fears it may become a super spreader for dengue. Four million Americans are expected in Paris, and just a handful returning with infections could be enough to trigger an epidemic here. French authorities are deploying teams of dengue detectives to eradicate tiger mosquito breeding grounds near Olympic venues. Infectious disease expert Dr. William Schaffner. When you go out and about, wear loosely fitting clothing with long sleeves, not short sleeves, and long trousers because that obviously will discourage mosquito bites. And then the other thing, which is very important, use insect repellent. There are already about 2,000 dengue cases like Rosie's in the U.S. so far this year. And you experts are warn the numbers are likely to grow. This year it's like blowing up, like record high numbers. Global warming, which has led to rising temperatures and increased rainfall, is believed to be behind the increase in mosquito populations that spread dengue fever. One official with the World Health Organization calls the outbreaks, quote, a canary in the coal mine of the climate crisis.